to provide though, you're not looking macho, I promise when I go psycho, they think I'm Randy Camacho, I'm savage, trying to put together what I can sell. What's going on YouTube? I'm the goods on YouTube. TG so good everywhere else. As you guys already know, NBA 2K25 will be making an appearance on PC with the new gen version of the game on the way to PC. Uh, a lot of PC players, including myself and modders, we have a lot to catch up on. If you have not been playing the new gen version of the game, alongside the PC version of the game in recent years. Now, most of you know PC, we've been getting the older gen version of the game, but with the newer gen version of the game, it's gonna come some perks for us. So first and foremost, the one I wanna touch on because PC has something very special that we can use, um, mini games. So the mini games is exciting to me because if we are able to use custom rosters and we're still able to mod, we'll be able to use different custom environments so we can set up these mini games to have any player on any court that we can mod into the game. Now, I would like to use a tool called Parsec to play with some community members who don't have the game on PC. All you guys need is just a controller to hook up to your PC and a Parsec link that um, I guess whoever's hosting the game will have to send out. So in my case, it'll be me sending out a link uh, for you guys to play. But this, this should break up things, break up the monotony of having to play full games. This will be something kind of fun to just jump in and out of. But with PC and being able to use Parsec, like you could play with your friends that don't even have this game. If you're on PC, you'll be able to just, as long as they have a computer and a controller that they can hook up to the computer, they'll be able to play along with us. At least that's how it has been in recent years. So I see no reason why this still can't happen. This is one of the things that I'm looking forward to. I love to hear you guys' ideas to add on to what I'm talking about. Um, with the mini games and using Parsec plus mods to take this game mode itself online. Moving on from discussing the mini games, I want to talk about the jump and adjustment that PC players are going to have to make. If you've only been playing NBA 2K on PC or you haven't played it with any of the new gen version of the game it's going to take some adjustment you're going to have to learn uh the menus you're going to have to learn of course the controls are going to be very different this year um so it's going to take some time adjusting to the game so don't i think being able to have this game on pc and do different things with it while you learn the new gameplay will actually cause some people who will just now be playing PC for the first time, 2K on PC for the first time, it'll actually cause them to be a little, I, I wanna say a little less stressed or whatever, just because you're gonna be experiencing so, so much freedom that you haven't been able to experience on the console side that it's like, okay, I can learn the game I mean, it's already exciting having a brand new game and then you've got it on PC and then with PC, you can do so much customization, but I would definitely say take time to learn everything that's going to be in the game, especially with the menus, because it's going to enhance your overall experience. And this is where I think PC can really separate itself. The overall experience when you can customize your experience um it just takes it it the ceiling for the potential for enjoyment it, it like it takes the cap off like right? it, it goes your the potential for enjoyment is through the roof when you can customize various things that you never even thought about customizing 
So, or even if you're a content creator, um, having this game, the new gen version, you know, the most up to date technological version of this game available to you on PC, where you already have great minds doing all kind of creative stuff. Like it just takes the ability to enjoy the game up a level without needing to go to the park and feel like you got to level up. There's so many creative and original ideas and ways to play the game that you can actually capitalize on on PC that it is it's it's almost dangerous. It's almost dangerous because you can find yourself just simply like customizing the game at all times, modifying the game, modding, whatever you want to call it. But you could find yourself just doing this all day. And if you could lose, like if you could lose yourself in this game, if you, if you ever were a roster creator, I know roster creators, you definitely can lose yourself in this game or people that create jerseys, all the people that look for fine, minute details and ways to like really have their own, custom experience like once you get on pc and you start to see different ways you can touch the game like i know there's people that say there are no gameplay mods there actually are gameplay mods <laughs> so yeah it can affect gameplay too now i don't know what level of modding we'll get to with nba 2k25 but i'm i'm excited for the potential so, having said that, I'm the goods. I'm gone.